This SKF training film is about spherical roller bearings with a cylindrical bore. The spherical roller bearing consists of an inner ring with two raceways and two rows of spherical rollers in separate cages, a guide ring and an outer ring with a sphered raceway. This bearing is capable of both static and dynamic misalignment and can operate in conditions of heavy loads and shock loads. This bearing is suitable for applications like conveyors, bridges and cranes and other applications like paper mills and gearboxes, all of which carry high loads and can have some operational shaft deflection or misalignment. For mounting spherical roller bearings with a cylindrical bore, heat is used. Spherical roller bearings generally have tighter interference fits than other bearing types, therefore heat is the most common mounting technique. SKF provides a wide range of bearing induction heaters for this purpose. Do not heat the bearing above 110 degrees centigrade. Always use protective gloves and hold the bearing against the housing shoulder until it cools sufficiently to grip the shaft. Dismounting a spherical roller bearing with a cylindrical bore can be greatly assisted if the shaft is prepared for oil injection. In this case, a combination of mechanical and oil injection dismounting techniques is used. After connecting the oil injection equipment, high pressure oil is pumped between the bearing bore and the shaft whilst a jaw puller assists the removal of the tightly fitted bearing. When using high pressure oil equipment, it is important for personal safety to use protective clothing and glasses. Spherical roller bearings with a cylindrical bore are supplied with a predetermined amount of radial internal clearance. When the bearing is mounted with an interference fit, this clearance will be reduced. Make sure when replacing bearings that the new bearing has the same radial clearance as the one being replaced, for example C3 or C4.